Hello and welcome to a new player review. So it's Friday past six, uh, we have the new batch of uh, Future Star players and at a first look, a very quick look that I gave them, they look, uh, I think, way better than the first batch. Uh, we also had a Tierney in an SPC, we also had Osterman in Objectives, which looked like very interesting players. Uh, but I'm going to start off with the uh, first player that caught my eye, which is going to be this Jonathan Ikone from uh, Lille, a cam, but uh, very good pace, very good dribbling, uh, good shooting, good passing, okay physical. I mean, his face card looks very, very good, uh, especially for that league that lacks, uh, aside from Neymar, a good uh, cam. Um, it looks like a very nice card, like I said, so I went ahead and bought him. Uh, Right away, uh, 270. I don't know where his price is gonna be. De it depends how he plays in game. If this card plays really well, I, su I suspect his price is gonna go up. Um, so his base card is a 78. Um, so it goes to 87. Not a huge upgrade that we've seen with these uh, future stars, but still is nine rating. So it's a big upgrade. Uh, he doesn't get an upgrade on his weak foot or his skill moves. Those were four star, four star, which is very nice. He has a uh, high medium work rate which are okay or great for maybe a cam, uh, not for a CM or anything, um, you know, uh, backwards uh, in the midfield. Uh, so this is a pure attacking player as a cam. And without pace, you may even see him on the wing or even see him as a striker. Uh, so he's uh, 175, so he's like 5'9", uh, like we said, high medium, left footed with four star, four star. Uh, his details are looking very nice. His pace is overall 94 with 95 acceleration, 94 sprint speed. Uh, a fantastic for a cam. You rarely see, if at all, any cams that will have uh, this much pace. Uh, shooting overall 83. I already applied a dead eye to this card. Uh, attack positioning 88, we go to 99. Uh, finishing 83, we go to 98. Shot power 88, we go to 98. Long shots 80 to 85. Uh, his passing is over 86. That should have been a bit more higher for a cam. But still at 86, it looks like a, a good a good rating. Uh, Vision 94 to 95, crossing 81 to 86. Um, short pass 87 to 97, and curve 93 to 98. So uh, only his long pass is a bit low at 77. The rest are looking really well there, and especially with a dead eye, you get short pass 97, curve 98, um, and Vision 99. Uh, dribbling uh, the highest stat after his pace at overall 92 with 99 agility, 89 balance, 88 reactions, uh, 90 ball control, 92 dribbling, and 89 composure. I think uh, these are uh, great looking stats for your cam. Uh, no defending, so you can't really play him like a CDM or a CM. Uh, physical overall 70. It's not that low, it's just his jumping that makes it go uh, really low, the overall rating, uh, 42, but stamina 86. Uh, it depends. It looks all right, but it might not be enough as a cam. We'll have to see. Uh, strength 61, uh, that's a bit low, with aggression 75. So uh, I think everything is looking uh, really, really nice here. Um, nothing um, bad about this card, only as a cam, his long pass is a bit short and his strength is a bit low there as well. But the rest are looking really nice. So. Uh, we're gonna go into a couple of games of foot champions. Um, we're gonna test out this guy, obviously in the first game as a cam, if we like what we see. Then we want to try him in another uh, position, maybe as a winger with that pace, uh, or even as a striker, we'll see how it goes. Okay, so here we go with the first opponent. A very nice Serie A team. Very nice players there. Cristiano Ronaldo up top and Mertens. Dybala, Politano, Sanchez, great, great team. Uh, so we're going to go into this game in the 4-2-3-1 formation and we're going to play Kone Future Stars in the central camp position. There he is, first touch. Nice, fast, good agility. The ball, nice. Go back, no? Through here, yes. Oh, we turn right. What the hell is that goal? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Oh my god. Nice pass. Oh, shoot. Oh, nice. So, where's that feed? There it is. Oh no. It's bad me. Power. Shoot. It saves that. 
go. Shoot. Yes, there we go. One, one. Too much there. So we're gonna go. Oh, yes. No. Oh. oh, shoot. Foul. There we go. Good foul. There we go. Ooh, what a goal. Of course he does. Jonathan Ikone scoring the first goal. Let's check it out. that all right and that's game we'll get a, the first win with a nice free kick by Jonathan Ikone. Uh good game all in all um, I like him as I can the finishing wasn't really there he gets man of the match with 8.8 .8, uh, one goal uh, four and six shots on target 13 and 16 passes 16 and 24 dribbles and two and four tackles so he did everything on the field his fitness is minus six. It was all right. I think he lasted 90 minutes okay in a camp position. So uh, a really nice game. I really like him. His speed is there. He's very explosive. So with that, I want to go into the second game. And this time, I'm going to try him down the wing. Uh, with his speed, I think uh, he might work wonders uh, on either side of the field. All right, so here we go with our second game. A nice Prem team with uh, La Liga and Serie A Brazilians there. Very nice pass to Packers. And Salah and Vardy. Um, all right, so we're going to go into the game again in the 4-2-3-1 formation, but this time Icon is going to play at the right wing uh, position and uh, we'll have him with no instructions to see how he plays in that position. Hello. Oh, wow, there it is. Great control. Oh, we got in. That's a good thing. Shoot. No, we can't shoot there. Again, the ball. Nice. Pass, shoot. And the other. Yes, and we score. One nil. Yeah. We have speed. We should have. Come on, let's see. There's the speed. Nice. Pass. Oh, almost. Get him in the. I don't understand how. How am I <laughs> conceding these goals? Pass, another one. And now, yes. Shoot. Good goal. Come on. Two one. Pass, nice. The ball, yes. Go. Now score. Oh my god, what the hell? Go. Pass. There. Shoot and score. There we go. That was an excellent shot and an excellent goal. There it is. What a goal. How is he saving these shots? Oh, what a ball. Get it, get it, Jonathan. Yes, no. There we go, go back. Nice. Wow. Dribble, shoot. Shoot. There's a goal. Oh, we did get a race quit. Okay. So, 9.2 for Jonathan Ikane with two goals, no assists, four and six shots on target. 
6 on 12 passes, 13 on 17 dribbles, 1 failed tackle, less fitness now, minus 5, an excellent job down the wing. Uh, I also enjoy them here as well. I think it's another position you can play. So let's go back and uh, have a look at this card. So Jonathan Ikone, um, Future Stars. I think this is a fantastic card. I really, really like it. Uh, two games, three goals. One as a cam, a central cam. Uh, two goals as a winger on the right side. I really, really like it. And the first game, I was kind of uh, worried a bit because uh, he seemed to not have the finishing there. We took uh, two or three shots that uh, weren't going in, although he had an excellent free kick. But on the second game, uh, we saw that he had uh, excellent finishing. He scored two goals. Uh, very nice shooting. Very good dribbling. That high agility is so nice in game. With uh, paired with that high acceleration and sprint speed that he has, he's so quick on his turn. Um, with great balance and good reactions, good ball control. Um, his stamina is great for either a central cam or a winger. I didn't find any problems there. His passing was very nice as well. I think this is a very, very nice card, especially for the league on. Like I said, there's uh, realistically no other cam uh, if you take out Neymar. Uh, with stats like these, I can play like this with four star, four star, with great speed, um, shooting, passing, dribbling, everything on this card. Especially, I don't think you can find many cards that are central cards that I can play down the wing, which is a very big plus for this card. I believe that this card will probably excel if you play him down the wing uh, instead of a central um, position. But um, I, I believe that he can also play well in that central role as a cam and even as a striker. Um, he's really not that small compared to other wingers that we saw uh, lately that, that are like 5'7 or 5'6 or something like that. He's 5'9 or 5'10, something like that. So uh, I believe that this is an excellent, excellent card. Like I said, I bought him at 270. I'm not sure where he is right now, but even at that price, um, like around 250 maybe, I think this is a great card if it fits in your team, especially with the cards now with like Ben Yedders and Mbappes and cards like that uh, and uh, Lala right back. Uh, this card could fit right in. It can also uh, fit into many hybrids without French connection. So I really, really like this card and I believe this is a great, great card to add to your team. So this is going to be it for this review. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.